Okay, so this is my last video, and I'm going to pull out Arco Iris Rojo. That's the Spanish word, and I dare anybody to figure out what it means. Arcus, Arco Iris Rojo. So I'm going to do this one with the spoon method again. <clears throat> Excuse me, so I'm going to just sweep over my clear coat. And again, this is just to emulate having laid my... Uh, clear base or maybe even done my fill in on my clear base underneath my color and co uh, color and glitter acrylic and I got that way too soft so and way too much of it sheesh Dan are you tired Did that one a little weird, but it happens, right? So, couldn't grab my spoon. And yay! This one's just so pretty. And it's got some different little shapes and whatnot in it, too. But sometimes it's fun to just have it as a nice red hollow mix you can really see all those glitter specks that's hollow and you can really see it when the camera is unfocused mm. trying to make a decision i'm gonna pick up just a little bit more glitter just to focus on a couple of my Kind of special shapes that are in there. I'm sorry if I'm out of focus, guys. One of these days, I'm going to have a really nice camera set up, and then I'll show them. <laughs> I'm just going to do a quick clear coat. To encapsulate it. And I love as soon as I put on that clear coat, you know, it like dulls the shine of the um, glitter. But then suddenly you can see every single thing that's in it oh encapsulated glitter you are my best friend <laughs> hella glitter on my brush why not use it right Shaping it a little bit with my brush while it's still damp enough to move. And... There we go. That just about does it. Okay. So I'm going to see you soon. And I'm going to post all the photos so you can see everything. But then stay tuned because later on today I have a very important announcement. And you don't want to miss it. Okay. I'm trying to help you get ready for the Valentine's Day rush. Bye.